Okay. This is the Bella Augusta. Here we have the interiors of the main dining hall. Those are actual jade flowers back there. Three jade plants right there. Some detail work on the tables. Crew spa. Moving on. The interior of the dining room itself there. Main room. With two, illumi with two um, illuminated glass orbs there. And a Greco Roman statue on the landing. Maybe the lower floor through the on the windows. Probably sneak this in here. A better view. That's the whole interior. Viewed from the passenger perspective here. This right here is the main club and bar area. This shows a backroom bar as well. This whole room is original to the original ship that was here. It's an older ship that's been converted over and rebuilt. This is one of the original rooms from that first ship. Been reconditioned to serve as the main focal point for the Iroquois. Hodnosi passed, and I have showcased work from Joseph Jacobs on the back wall here, which people can look in and, and see that. You can see various examples of his work. The original dance floor, it's been reconditioned. New lights, new windows, new everything basically. And now we move on to what we have as the casino. Here, with a full back panel of glass on the dance floor here. Move on to, well, this is for the Grace Cruises banner. Another view of this, of the whole side. She's almost 12 feet long and 2 feet wide. Here we have the Navajo Dream Pool and Spa area. This one was, this is probably the most favorite uh, room amongst all the people who've seen it so far. It's a reconstruction of what I believe the Navajo people in particular um, could recognize. A large dream catcher in the back right there. Uh, perched on a sculpture kind of rock in the background right there. This 
so this is a, a favorite definitely the back work on the wall is a copy of a commissioned artwork made for this ship by Andy Green the original is on my wall but there it is way back there as part of the ship's decor and finally up here we have the main exercise and activity room facing out the back end of the ship with vegetation and so on that's got lights planted within it and tiny little treadmills which are so darn cute and finally once again way down the way down the middle of the ship with some detail of the ceiling above right there and all the way down through to the middle top end of the ship see the whole run of the casino right down to the very end and toward the dance floor remember this is about almost five feet away right here to the very end five or six feet down so that's five or six feet of ship right there in just that one view So, this is the Bella Augusta of Grace Cruises, which is a, really an Italian-oriented company, fake company, really made for this kind of ship, and she's one of the most beautiful I've ever made, so... To, to whom it may concern, um, I hope you like it, and... If you want to display it, that is quite cool. Thank you very much for your time. Alright, bye.